Hello guys, welcome to my channel Gajas Info. My name is Vina Karthik and today I am gonna give the full review of my new Android 7.0 Nugget uh, installed on my phone. Now let me quickly restart the phone to show the uh, boot speed. When coming to the boot speed, S7 Edge uh, goes like a rocket and the boot uh, is pretty fast. Samsung Galaxy S7 Edge 128GB variant. Now when coming to the phone, the boot speed is awesome guys. And it's official Android 7.0 nugget. So and this uh, Android 7.0 allowed the main um, Samsung uh, fix this issue. And the unlocking speed in this phone is boom. See you can see it. You can watch the unlocking speed is pretty good. As you can see, it unlocked very fastly. So, as you can see, the notification bar is cool and awesome. As you can see, we are getting blue light filter in the nugget. You can see here, it's pretty good feature. And we are getting location NFC smart view phone visibility. And you can see the UI, it's been awesome and it's been updated. Now, let, it's in high performance mode let me quickly turn off the high performance mode now quickly let me go to the settings and show you the android version of this as you can see about device my model is smg935 fd software info android 7.0 base version is dplt and it's a uk version as you can see and uh, it's not uh, naturally this phone does not come with volt and I think Samsung will uh, give the volt update and when you quickly go to display here we are getting the Note 7 features as you can see the screen resolution is in the 2k resolution and uh, we are getting and we can change the resolution into 1920 into 1080p etc etc now I am running it's um, my device in the 2k resolution I am going to apply this and now let me quickly go back to the back now quickly go to wallpapers and themes here we can uh, download the wallpapers etc etc now quickly let me go back to some advanced features here you can see smart stay games and uh, game launcher game tools helps in uh, recording your gameplay and uh, when you go back here you can see the device maintenance as you can see it's a new software like it's smart manager almost and when you optimize now and uh, when coming uh, when compared to smart manager this device maintenance is awesome like smart manager stuck sometimes that means i didn't like in uh, android 6.0 but in this as you can see we are getting battery performance mode storage ram etc when we go to performance mode it enhances like when you play uh, when you uh, playing uh, the game uh, in game mode it runs smoothly entertainment and and if you want to change in the high performance mode it will apply like it will increase the high brightness and and will change the screen resolution into maximum and uh, and if you play a video in high performance mode it will enhance your feeling and storage as you can see my name is one to um sorry my device is 128 gigs variant and it's better than 32 gb variant so i feel that 128 gigs is pretty good for me and uh, samsung made a pretty feature like adding a memory card in this so as you can see when i am going to ram i will clean off my ram as you can see the ram has been cleaned and uh, now as you can see the ui has been updated and uh, I love this UI so much and um, Samsung fixed this unlocking speed of uh, the fingerprint scanner fingerprint sensor now let me go to some actually you can see the software has been updated a lot as you can see the uh, UI like you can see the settings in white and some blue somewhere as you can see the, yeah, the taskbar runs very cool and very smoothy as you can see the now I will show you some wait let me go back 
as you can see settings here you can see the features messages no way play music etc as you can see the notification bar guys the task bar multi window As you can hear, sound is loud. So we got update, and now let me go to if you press the yes file. I mean, if you play, if you press any apps, here you can get um, the Android seven point zero, and you can um, quickly go to app info and install to put to sleep. If you go to app info here, you can get this. I will quickly. Full this. I mean, I will. No, I uh, no. It didn't go up. I will clear off this. Even I will clear off everything. As you can see, app info. See. So now let like, quickly go to camera. As you can see the camera. the shutter speed is awesome when you right click when you swipe like this here you can see auto pro panorama etc etc and uh, as you can see we are getting uh, film um, retro and we are getting some modes and here we can download uh, all the other modes also now let me quickly go to settings and here you can uh, record your video into 4k videos and yeah the back camera we can record in 4k and front we can in 2k as you can see front 2560 into 1440 and back 3840 into 2160 and the camera has been updated as you can see here the front cam there up and uh, the record button here and uh, as you can see here the clarity goes awesome now let me quickly click my this samsung galaxy s7 edge The shutter speed is awesome, as you can see here. The clarity goes awesome. So now let's go to some edge features. As you can see, Samsung fixed this edge also. Like in Marshmallow, I faced some lagness when I swipe like edge features. But uh, in this, as if you immediately swipe this, you are getting this. now let's go to taskbar as you can see as you already saw the multi window feature etc etc so and we are waiting and even we are getting the samsung pay with this now let's go to some system apps we are getting phone messages internet Samsung apps like My Files, etc., Voice Recorder, S Health, etc., etc. So as you can see, my device in a high performance mode. Now I will uh, quickly disable this high performance mode. I will keep. I will uh, change it to power saving mode. When you keep, when you change the resolution, in, when you want to power save mode, it it will uh, go back to. 1920 into 1080p resolution as you can see the ui is awesome guys now the power saving mode goes on so the fine samsung made a pretty nice update for this and i think samsung will get will uh, give volt fix for this now i am the 4g is running cool but we are uh, we should get some volt update see you as you can see 4g as you can see so it's working pretty fine but we should get volt update guys i'm uh, pretty serious about that so samsung i hope samsung will give that and it, it will give so don't worry guys so in the next video i am going to uh, tell you that 
in the next video i will show you how to install uh, this android 7.0 nugget on any samsung galaxy s7 edge and uh, you can uh, install firmware uh, and if you are uh, an holder of SMG935 FD as you can see here about device model number and you can flash uh, the SMG935F firmware on your phone as you can see it's uh, DPLT so our based version is uh, um, here BPJJ but uh, we can flash DPLT and it's been booted in the next video I will show you how to install and I will uh, give the description of the firmware to download actually I have downloaded on the SAM firmware and uh, a lot of people uh, so I downloaded the firmware and uploaded in the uh, Google Drive so I will give the link in the description and the next video I will show you how to install the firmware easily and uh, thanks for watching Please like and subscribe guys. Happy New Year. Yalla yalla. Bye.